I was going through my comment section and I saw a comment and I believe it is someone's testimony or talking about some things in the past or perhaps currently. So let me read it to you and I want you all to help me pray for this person. Okay. I am a born again Christian, probably have sinned more than I was supposed to. The strange thing is I felt my wrongs and knew it went against everything that I know about who Jesus, the Son of God, meant and who he is. Love. I am not looking for approval. I am telling you the truth about how real my life and struggle has been. Me, myself, full of fornication, lies, malice, slander, dishonoring both my mother and father, hitting my mother, cursing her, disrespecting the one that gave me opportunity, disrespecting the one that gave me life, God, Jesus, the one who gave me guidance and direction, the Holy Spirit. I have gossiped, made fun of disadvantaged people, stole and was a thief, masturbated, backslid, judged, and thought myself to be better than the next, practiced evil doctrines, tarot, psychics, palm reading, sleeping with married men knowingly and unknowingly, cursing God, ungrateful, unholy, prostitution, abused my children, the most innocent and couldn't de defend themselves. I am unworthy, didn't help people when I could or where there was position for me to. I've been hateful, angry, self-seeking, watched gay pornography, men on men, women on women, men and women and women, who are men, have sex with men, and men who are women having sex with men. Okay. I've been very mean and unkind. I wasn't slow to listen and slow to hearing. Okay. I've practiced sex acts with relatives and I am very ashamed of myself. I tell you this because there is a God. I still am in damnation because of some of these very things. I am trying to be free of the bondage. I know there is a heaven and there is a hell. 
may have doubted them both. I am gracefully broken. He is grace and mercy. And I am right in the same boat as my fellow friends that are friends in Christ. I know what to do. I'm struggling. My fleshly, hmm, my flesh is weak, but my spirit is willing. I've separated myself from the evils in which he said I'd be sure to have my portion in the lake of fire. Right now, as we speak, I'm guilty of speaking the word and being a hypocrite at the same time. I don't want to go there either, so I am doing the best I can to let go of my pride and ego. The world and the things in it is surely to pass over. I am to confess so that I may be free. <clears throat> I am 29 years old and I am still fighting the good fight. I am a real sinner after a real God after a real eternity after real love after real life after real harmony after forgiveness after a changed life indefinitely I must go to all those I hurt and ask for forgiveness and hope to be forgiven. I am discouraged for us all. It is very hard. The road to life is narrow and few find it, but the road to death is broad and wide and many are on it fear isn't of the lord so i am brave and will not stop until i get where i am promised to be i have been touched on and made to do things i didn't want to i have been embarrassed humiliated laughed at, talked about, abused, abandoned, treated unfairly, lied on, played with, taken advantage of, used, manipulated. Something about the name Jesus, sweetest thing I know. I have not given up on fixing myself. I have not given up on myself or destiny. P-U-S-H. Push. Okay. Pray until something happens. I'm not where I used to be and my heart is softer. He is emptying me of me to fill me with more of him. Pray for me. I will continue praying for all of us. I already feel weight lifted. All glory to God. It's time to get real with yourself, personal, about the fight and real about reality god bless so i want you all to help me pray for this person 
I believe this person is still having trouble. So if you are willing, please help me pray for this person. God bless you.